we have the seven of wands energy it looks like someone cannot be touched it looks like they have whoever this is you have something that can't be touched let me get something here with this we have the emperor here okay let me get something okay i'm seeing people like we're just going to say they can't touch it whatever it is they cannot touch it they can't we have the two of swords here but they're trying they're trying here they're trying to grab something here like when you're not looking or they're trying to do something when you're not looking we have the knight of cups energy here i don't know why i just got somebody fake i got somebody like a fake friend for some reason we have the seven of pentacles here okay what came out with the seven of pentacles the five of cups like it's like somebody okay I don't know why they're trying to get you to stop what you're doing. You see how they're doing something with this Seven of Pentacles? They're trying to complete something, but you got this damn ugly-ass voice breathing down your neck back here. It's something you're trying to complete with that Seven of Pentacles, but they're trying to get you to, like, go away or something like that. They're trying to get you to go because you're getting on somebody's nerve. You see how her head is? She's like, oh, my God, like, please. I know this is probably in the card. It's probably her feeling like, oh, my goodness, I didn't want that person to go. But here, the way that I'm picking it up is like, please get the fuck out of here. Please leave because there's something here they can't touch. They can't touch it. Let me get something here with this Knight of, of Cups. Yeah, they can't touch it. You have protection around you. We have the Sun card here. It's something here. They're going towards the light. They've been in a dark cave or something like that is what I'm getting. Let me get something here with this. I feel like there's mixed energy here. There's some people that adore you. There's some people that are in awe. There's some people that want to grab this shit, but they can't. There's some people that are happy. There are some people that are trying to get the shit. It's like a lot going on here. Let me get something. It's also about somebody's heart being exposed with this Knight of Cups and the Sun card. And then we got the Strength card here. It's like somebody being able to tame the beast or tame a beast. It could be the beast within. It could be a beast on the outside somewhere. Let me get something because these energies, they're not able to touch whatever this is that you have. They can't do it. You're the master of it. We have the Knight of Swords. Well, not the Knight of Swords. I'm sorry. The Page of Swords energy here wow now this is some scary shit the way that this look right here there's somebody that wants your wants some type of information the page of sword is about getting information trying to understand something that they don't understand but it's somebody here they look real fucking evil like i'm really not feeling it they got some weird ideas or some shit stirring in their head what's this at the bottom we got the eight of cups here this is so crazy somebody's walking away who is this that's walking away? They're abandoning something. Somebody doesn't want to go into the same story or they don't want to make the same mistake. They don't want to do the same thing. I got to see what's underneath this eight of cups. And then we got the three of swords. Something's, I don't know what this is. I don't know if they want you to leave something behind or you, they want you to feel like, oh, I need to leave this behind because they want to get in your head about something because they can't beat you. They can't beat you. Okay. So they're trying to get in your head. They're trying to make you walk away from something because they can't beat you. That's what I'm getting here. Let me get something with this. We have the nine of sword. You see, it drives them crazy. They cannot touch it. They cannot. They cannot. They cannot. It's like putting your hand in the fire. They cannot. You'll be funny if you did something like that. Okay, what is this? We got the ten of pentacles here. We got the knight of cups. We got the fool card. It looked like somebody having a beautiful beginning with like a lot of resources here. A lot of financial security could be opening a business or something like that, but they're moving forward into new energy. And this is very abundant. And this may be driving somebody up a wall. Let me get something here with this because they can't touch something. They cannot destroy it. I really am getting the energy of somebody that's doing something to get what you have, but they just can't get it. They just cannot. We have the four wands. It is solidified. It is something here where there's like a rite of passage here or you've already crossed the line. It's already the finish line. You didn't already finish some shit. Okay. It's something here. It could even be about the community. There's like strong ties here with something. Let me get something here with this two of swords. Damn. We got the eight of swords here. The eight of sword is like wanting to restrict somebody. Or isolate somebody here. Or make them think negatively about themselves or saying negative things here because they can't win no matter what. We have the Hierophant energy here. Okay. It's something about the laws. It's something about knowing the laws, following the laws, being a part of some type of 
I don't know how to say like even when you just know the spiritual laws sometimes it's the systems that are put in place in this world that are meant to educate that's sometimes what the hierophant is and it's about traditions but it's with this this knight of pentacles i mean i'm sorry this knight of cups energy here so it's something about the heart also and doing what's in your heart hmm Maybe it's something like when you want to make decisions at an institution and like maybe other people are opposed to certain things, but these are good changes. These are what is necessary and there's nothing that they can do to stop something. It's nothing that they can do to change something. It's a necessary change that's happening. There's also an energy of people not being able to act like they're not seeing something or not no excuse for something here. Like, okay. Let me get something with this sun card. Because there's something here where they're seeing the light. Yeah, we got the three of wands here. It's something that it is moving forward. It's moving forward to something more successful, something better. Something that's more guided towards truth here with this sun card. Because I see people that's really going through it here because of something that you're able to do or something that you're doing. You're doing it and they cannot touch it. They can't stop whatever changes what is this? Was that the two of swords? Yeah, that was the two of swords here. Okay. So it's something here like, oh my goodness. Is that like a decision? It's not, it doesn't look like a decision. It looks like something in the in-between. Like something that's pending perhaps. Something that's waiting for a green light. But they want you to walk away because they can't stop the change. So you cannot let them get in your head before this happens. It feels like it's something that's not yet completed. We have the Knight of Swords. See, here's somebody come trying to get in your ear. And this is with the Strength card here. It's someone, you have to overpower the beast. I don't know who the fuck this is. You got to overpower the beast because you do have something and they fear that shit. They fear it because they can't defeat it. We have the Chariot energy here. We have Cancer energy. It's something here moving forward, man. They're trying to, I'm getting like slander or like, um like that political type of shit where they like make the, the commercials and shit, the commercials about you. It's like they can't stop something, but this is a good change is what I feel. It's something here that's true. It's pending and it's truly something from the heart. And I feel like they're leaving, it's something about leaving the old ways behind. Let me get something here with this nine of sword. This is leaving the old ways behind. They cannot stop this change that's happening. The, the old times is being left behind here. You're not walking away from this. This is something that you ha you can have power. I mean, you will have power over pretty much. You will have power over this, this shift. We have the Knight of Wands energy here. And you're acting on it too. Whatever is being acted on is it's worrying these people. Because they can't do anything about it. Let me get something here. We have Justice here. Mm-hmm. It's like these people can try to get in your head. But when you're already focused on something when you already got your mindset when you already got your purpose or whatever it is you're, you're inspired to do okay with this knight of wands energy that's somebody that goes and does whatever it is we got the queen of sword energy here hmm who is this queen of sword here queen of sword has the eight of sword above their head though like somebody that has a limited belief i don't know if this is an air sign they have a limited belief about something or they just don't understand. Maybe they don't want to fucking understand. Maybe they want to stay, they want to keep some shit broken or confused or some shit. And it's like, nah. So the fact that you're trying to fix something is the problem. I think that's what this is. Somebody wants to keep something broken and you're coming along and you're fixing it. They want you to go away. Let me get something here with this Hierophant. We have the Magician energy here, Virgo, Gemini. Yeah, it is something you have the you have a real ability here, especially with Hierophant and the Magician. It's something about maybe a belief or maybe you have some type of title of some sort. It's like real. Like when somebody comes into a business and they change the whole fucking business, that's something that should not be taken lightly. Let me get something here with this three of wands. We have the queen of wands energy here. Okay. And this is coinciding with this Knight of Wands energy. It's something about your energy. You're looking like a fire sign or you are a fire sign or you're looking like someone very confident, somebody independent, somebody that is a, a for real true leader, a for real true leader and, they, and uses their abilities here. 
that's what someone's being seen as. And other people, they're, whoever this queen of swords is, they're being seen as like in the past or they got an outdated belief system or they just don't get it. They just don't see it. There's something here. It's not right. It's not right. And there's a shift that's going on with this two of swords. What is this here? We have the page of sword out here for the second time. For the second time, it's always an air sign and a fire sign. It was like that in the last reading. I'm telling y'all, it's something here with the air signs and the fire signs. They're not getting along in this reading. Usually they be good, but they're not getting along in these readings lately. I've been noticing that because now we got the page of sword looking at the queen of wands. It's something it, even with this queen of sword and the knight of wands it's something where justice is being served and it's not working out in the queen of wands favor. It's not working out in this air sign favor. This air sign thought they knew something or they thought they had something in the bag. Maybe they studied some shit or maybe they looked up some shit or maybe they went to school for some shit, but they ain't studied hard enough. I'm just being honest. I don't know what it is for real, for real, but whatever it is, they can't touch you on that shit. And it's driving them and saying they wish you would go some fucking where because you're making them look like they don't know what the fuck they're doing or what they're talking about. And that's just really exposing the truth. They don't know. Let me get something here with this chariot. We have the death card here. It's something here they're not going to be able to move forward with. They think they're going to be with this page of sword, but they can't. That's like a little 15 year old trying to get in the car. You ain't never even had a lesson in driving. Okay. You don't know how to drive this car. Okay. Let me get something here with this knight of wands. Nah, it's them that's going to have to abandon some shit. We have the Ten of Wands energy. Yeah, Knight of Wands is not playing. I'm telling you, that Seven of Wands, that first card where, like, you're holding something and everybody is surrounding it but nobody can touch it, that shit spoke volumes. That shit spoke some volumes here. That shit spoke volumes like nobody can touch it. I don't give a fuck. It might even be somebody that calls himself an emperor or some shit like that. They can't even touch the shit, okay? Let me get something here with this Justice. Like someone that may be a boss of some shit. Somebody may be a CEO. Somebody may be the owner of some shit, but not with your businesses. They can't take it down. They can't talk shit. They can't do nothing. They can't touch it. That's what I mean. In no way, form, or fashion can they touch the energy that you're bringing. And everybody sees it. Everybody feels differently. There's mixed emotions. But there's really nothing that can be done other than they're trying to get you away. They're trying to get you out of here. Let me get something with this. And we got the Ace of Cups energy. Something here with these cups, too. I'm getting healing here. I'm getting something that it has to do with love. It has to do with new connections here. A new connection. We have the strength card here. The strength card is out here for the second time. And I said that this strength card, it felt like it's like a test. Like you have to tame some shit. Because this person, it's like Queen of Sword and the strength card. They may not know what the hell they're talking about, but they may know how to assert some shit or they may know how, you know what I'm saying? But they may not know how, what they're talking about though. They know how to bring some type of lion or fire or some shit, but no, it's like that can't, I don't know how to say. There's a element of a shift in time, a shift in mindset, a shift in consciousness. There's an element of that. And they're going to try to keep some shit the way, some old way or some shit. They're going to try to keep that, but they can't because it's shifting. It's meant to change. And whatever it is you bring, you're shifting it. We have the seven of swords here. Here they go with that bullshit. Here they go with that bullshit. So they're really trying to do something here. Or if they got to resort to lying, whatever they got to do. Yeah, we have the high priestess and it's here with the queen of wands. So it's something about this fire sign. Hmm. This fire sign knowing something, this fire sign having secrets of some sort, this fire sign being a mysterious figure of some sort. And, and like... It's something about the direction, like somebody's about to change direction in, in like a business or or something here. And other people are going to feel some type of way about it, but it's going to be a positive thing. It's going to be what's necessary. But what's amazing about it is that really can't nobody stop you. The only thing they can do is try to talk you out of it, but they can't physically stop you because you have the power to do so. They could even go as far as to put fake ass informations out there or something like that, but that's not even going to work. We have the Page of Pentacles here. Yeah, they trying to plant seeds and shit because that's right underneath the Page of Sword. Let me get something here with the Death card. And then we got the Fool card. So it looked like something's going to end and there's going to be a new beginning here. It's going to end. I don't know what they're going to try to plant, but it's not going to do anything. Okay? Even the Fool card is about innocence here. So it's something here where it's just meant to go. It's meant to move forward. We got the King of Swords here. So you know better than them in some type of way. And it drives them crazy. You know the information. You know the shit. You know your stuff. 
they may not know their stuff. I don't know what this is, but I'm seeing they can't touch you. You may be working among other people. I don't know. You know, everybody is not the same. Everybody's, you know, education ain't the same. Everybody didn't learn the same thing. Everybody is just different. But it's something here where you're bringing a change for real. You're bringing a change and the change cannot be stopped. Let me get something here with this Ten of Wands. We have the Seven of Cups here. Let me get something here with this Seven of Cups. What was that? We got the Five of Swords, like feeling like something is like too up in the air or so many options, so many choices, not knowing what to do, how to handle something. It's a lot on somebody's shoulders right now also. Let me get something here with this Strength card. It's like they have a conflict with the healing. I think I said that. Here's the Page of Sword again. If this Page of Sword come out one more time, this joint is, is out here three times. It's out here three times. One, two, and three. Like, I don't know. I don't think they're going about this fair. I don't think they're going about it the right way. I think they're just trying to have their way and just overpower the situation without regard to understanding that the shit is meant to change. It's meant to be upgraded. It's meant to go further. It's meant to go deeper. We're not meant to repeat the same fucking story all the damn time. It's something like that. Like going through the same thing again after generation, generation. It's like it's something that has to change. And there's somebody that has been brought into the picture to change it. And you're driving people crazy because this is just what it is. People don't like change. Well, some people don't like change. We have the Four of Wands energy here. You see in that Four of Wands with the Emperor. Now is somebody trying to attack what is already stable. Seven of Swords above that Four of Wands. And the Magician there. They're trying to attack this. They're trying to attack it because they can't touch something. They're trying to attack it. We have the Page of Cups and try to look innocent and shit. But you already know. You already know what it is. Let me get something here. We got the Four of Swords here. Let me get something with this Fool card. And then we got the star. Wow. You're really going to make this shit happen. Whatever. Like, I mean, I can't. I, this whole row right here, from the star to the fool to the death, the chariot, like, it's going to move forward. It's final. It's like a final decision here. And maybe they don't understand or they not. They just not going to get the point until it's already over and said and done. But it's, look, temperance, it's happening. There's something here that's meant to be balanced. I guess people have profited or benefited off of a broken system. And it's not about to be broken no more, okay? We're going to have to, uh, you know, get that together. We're going to have to fix that. Let me get a message here with this. What is the energy here? It says crew. So people like, it's something about being in sync. So some people going to be with the change and some people not. And here's the dear John. Okay, so people going to get fired. Who, who's ever not with it, I don't know what they're going to do. I don't know what, you know... If it's not working, it's about to be gone. And it says resource. I mean, it says sap. It says resources, needed materials. Okay. Like the flow of life. If it's not flowing or if it's not like giving something or it's, it's if it's not working, it's out is what I'm getting. If you're not trying to contribute, it's out. You're out. Okay. It says rings. Okay. Something about strong connections. It says like-minded people. Interconnected. Like, we don't need no damn enemies on the ship. You know, we don't need nothing like that, okay? We need committed people. Mind you, the emperor works with a lot of people. We have vulnerability and freedom here and composure. So it's giving, like, if something is happening, but it's like... It's giving composure because I feel like someone is going to be tested in major ways. Like in ways where, oh, should I just give up on this? Should I just walk away? And it's like, no, that's why you were brought there to change something, to bring awareness to something. And as much as they hate it, it is what it is. And it needs to be. It needs to be. People need to be aware. Okay. I'm going to leave this one right here. If you like the way that I read, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for your likes, shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate it because it is how we get the messages out in order to elevate the collective. I love you guys, and I'll be back with another reading later. Bye.